So this is the interesting thing. The interesting thing is that 250 some years ago, the founding fathers of the United States and other philosophers in China and Europe were thinking about these very same issues, except you all are far more sophisticated actors than they were. Hmm. Believe it or not, right? Um, because we have, as a society, a far more better understanding of what rights are. We're all educated. We're literate. Okay, so this was a debate. This exact debate we just had was a debate that they were having 250 years ago, especially when they were writing the Declaration of Independence. Okay, they were thinking about what are human rights. There was philosophers like Locke and others who were thinking about what are, what are human rights? What is the social contract, right? Uh, between, between all of us, between us and the state? What are the agreements that we have? They may not be written agreements, but what are these agreements that we have, right? And so here's kind of the general consensus. I'm not saying this is a right answer or the wrong answer, but kind of the general consensus. Human rights are rights that you have because you are human. They are, what's the word? Yeah, well, in the declaration, it's inalienable, but yes. Inalienable or unalienable, right? What does that mean? You can't separate. Right, from who? From the body, from the Yeah, from the you cannot, no matter where you live, no matter what society you're from, no matter uh, who you are, if you are human, you have these rights. You cannot separate them from your existence. Yes, sir. Based yep. on what standard? Based on an agreement that society has had as a human society, right? So as human beings, um, so uh, human beings have decided, right, as a general consensus that these are things that you need to exist, no matter where you are. So for example, what do you think a, a human right should be? What are the most basic more, rights? More principle than norms that describe the human behavior. I'm sorry? The moral principle and norms that You're right. That's the problem we have with our country because we try to enforce our standards. Sure, sure, absolutely right. But human rights are beyond kind of those standards, right? So human rights are things like the right to sustenance. Without food and water, you don't exist, and all of this is moot. It doesn't really matter. The right to shelter. Without shelter, generally speaking, you will not survive long, all of this is a moot point. Okay, the right to, what's the most famous right in the Declaration of Independence, or the, the, yeah, Declaration of Independence? The right to, no? Life, right? Right to life. All of you who work in law enforcement are essentially focused initially on that first right, the right to life, protection of life. Right. Without that, pointless being a human being.